What's up guys, welcome to the vlog game, Maddie here as always, so yeah, today we are, we have a dilemma, right, where either you're gonna hate me, or you're gonna love me, so, but I think that's how it's always, right, so, or either you hate me or love me, but today I think I'm taking this to the next level. So, long story short, I remember when I started liking cars and stuff, the thing was Fast and Furious. I don't know if you remember that, Fast and Furious. I think you do, right? Uh, unless you are all younger than me, which you, are pro you probably are, or you are way older than me, which probably people watching here. Or if you have my age, you are probably right there with me, right? So back then, they had the, the famous neon underneath of the car. I always wanted that, but after a while, I think, you know, the car scene grew a little bit and they say like, no, this is horrible. But right now, it's coming back as an underglow. <laughs> and yes, you are not wrong. That's why you were probably watching this because I'm installing underglow on the Corvette. So I'm taking the car to Corvette at Carlisle and I want to have something different done to the car and I'll give it a shot. Why not? Right? Why not? So. If you like this, give me a thumbs up. If you don't like it, just watch for watching time. I really appreciate your support, as always. I got this underglow kit from Amazon for $72. And you have two ways to install this. It's pretty straightforward. Uh, you have LED strips uh, on the, the sides, front and back. And you can uh, just plug on your battery or you can pull uh, on a 12 volts battery uh, plug whatever like inside of the car or so on and so forth so the way i'm gonna do i'm gonna do the plug in the battery because i just want a clean install and it should be pretty easy to install so the kit's very simple um just the instructions and then if you see that that's what comes with the kit so i'm gonna open here so you can see so that's basically what we got here boys for the kit it's uh you know you got like the led strips uh and the connections itself i'm gonna lay down here so you can see better but it's, it should be pretty straightforward i hope it never is but we can make that happen or we don't so we'll see so here's what i did so i fished from there oh by the way let me show you the kit right so there's parts that goes on the front over here right it's because i put over here because i wanna i wanna do like uh, I want to connect to the battery. You have the option to connect to this, right? But I don't want to use this. This is like very cheap. You gotta put cables inside a car. I don't want that, right? So that's thing there. So what I did, you connect the the positive on your fog light uh, relay, right? And then. The positive, the negative goes to the battery. I didn't touch yet, but look at that. When you touch it, I put it there, so you can see. There you go. I'll, I'll do I'll do some wire management, so don't judge me. There you go. <laughs> there are the lights. Look at that. This is blue though, but uh, I can change by the app. And now the thing we need to do is just cable management. Attach it on the front, attach it on the back, on the side. So basically you have two sides, one for each side, right? Here, two pieces, one for each on the back and two for the front. It should be it. Have you ever heard about haters? I'm probably getting a bunch of them. So I love you, don't worry about it. You are welcome to stay and watch. Just enjoy the process or if it's painful, Look at that, how bright it is. So basically I will do some uh, cable management and that's it, we'll call the day. And it should be done, it should be a pretty straightforward installation though, so we'll see. Oh man, oh man, <laughs> this is 
crazy, man. Uh, look, at, it's so bright for an Amazon thing. It's super bright. So far, I'm happy. Of course, it's hard to tell with the car up in here. Uh, here's what I did with the wiring. And that's the hardest part though, right? So you can see here, there's a, it's like a little cable running there to the negative and here is to the positive. I leave here a little bit because if the wire cuts, then I have more wire to fix there. And then it's running here, rear, through there. And here, I'll try to show you here underneath how that's how it looks like underneath. It's pretty clean, pretty clean stall so far. So you basically have two on the front. Here's on the side. I put it right on the side skirts so it's not actually in the car, which is great, I love it. And here is on the back. Is the hardest part though, I'll tell you, is, for, is the cable management, right? But I think because I did, the the truck with the rock lights I, I kind of knew my way if you wish you saw a couple of clips how was i was working but uh yeah the hardest part is to put it uh see here you still can see the cable running there uh i don't think i'm gonna have any issue but i'll keep you guys posted a lot of zip ties and make sure it's clean uh, and that's it so just to give you guys idea Look how bright the thing is. <laughs> so what are we gonna do now? I'm gonna put it back on the floor and then we're gonna see with the car on the floor. Uh, it's too late to start the car so we have to wait another day so I can record the outro with the car outside, get a thumbnail and all the things. Another day, now it's 8, almost 8.40 the following day. Yeah, as you can see, I waited in just so I could see it uh, how dark it is. You guys know I live like middle of nowhere, so it's pretty dark. You only you barely can see my truck. My camera does adjust a lot, so better than me. But that's perfect for the review of the underglow. As you can see, I got a haircut, everything else, shower. Yesterday I finished. I start 8:30 ish. And I finish 11 o'clock. Worst part, cable management. I don't even know if I said that before, but because it, for me it was just yesterday, but for you guys, it was a couple of seconds ago. So anyway, just bear with me. <laughs> I'm very excited for it. Uh, if you hate it, you hate it. If you love it, you love it. Just be happy and don't hate me. Or even if you hate me, just watch until the end. Is that fair? 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 Let's go, review. What do you guys think? Man, it's bright. It's super bright. Look at that. I'm putting the lights on for the entire car so you can see better. Look at that. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, I love it. Look at that, how crazy it is. You can kind of change colors as I was explaining. Uh, you can change colors. This is blue. This is white, but here it looks like pink. This is pink. See the difference? This is like white but in the camera it looks like more pink kind of thing uh, you can do like stuff like this also see like you can change how that you know kind of flows and you can change how bright it is yeah it's pretty crazy <laughs> oh man underglow i never thought about it but i love it look at that look at that it's hard to take pictures of the car with that, but dude, it looks looks amazing. Let me put it how I how I would do it, right? This. That's probably how I, I would use it. And I'm saying like simple 
Brad, and that's it. That's more or less how it looks like with the car off. All right, let me put some lights here so we can see better. Look at that, I'm trying to put like some lights on my face so you can see me. But what do you think so far? A lot of people don't like it. Uh, to be honest, I, all, I was always a fan of it. But I never really thought about it, even though I have rock lights. But so far, let me know what you think. I really like it. Look here. I really like it. I hope you guys enjoy it. So if you like it, give me a thumbs up. And if I don't like it later, you know what I'm saying? I just pull it off. That's simple like that. It's not crazy. There's no holes in the car, nothing. So we good. We good. We good. So I hope you guys enjoy. Let me know what you think. I'll see you guys in the next one. Never forget, enjoy your life and work hard for it.